Translate 3D. To use Translate 3D, select XForm, then select Translate 3D. Mastercam will prompt you to select the entities you wish to translate. In my case, I'm going to draw a window around the solid. After I've selected my entities for translation, I can end the selection by pressing the Enter key on my keyboard or the green button to end the selection. I now have several options to set up in the Translate 3D window. I can choose to move the geometry I've selected, or I can make a copy of the geometry that I've selected. I can select this icon to add or remove geometry. I can come down here and afterwards tell it to regenerate the screen and fit the screen. I can also choose to use new attributes and place the geometry that I've moved to a new level and give it a new color. When moving, I have several options. The source view, in this particular case, I want to set this part up for turning on a lathe. So the existing top view, I'm going to move to the left side. So I can tell the source view is the top. And the destination for the top view will be the left side. I get the rectangle box showing me how it will move the part. If I wish, I can apply that. Because I chose apply, I'm still in the command. It wants me to continue selecting entities to translate. If I'm done with the command, I may press the escape key to end it, or I can continue translating. I'll re-select the part again. Some of the other options I have here, if I click on the source plane, I can change the plane I'm working in using the options here. Same with the destination, or if I have a plane I want to translate, maybe a compound angle, and it's not one of the standard views, I can select this icon and go out and select the center point of the face I'm going to use. In conjunction with this, selecting the plane, and I can move an angled face into a normal view.